As a former smoker, I understand the frustration and the fear that comes with quitting. But uh, with the new law that you signed yesterday regulating the tobacco industry, I'd like to ask you uh, a few questions. How many cigarettes a, a day? A few questions. Well, uh, <laughs> question. uh, how many cigarettes a day do you now smoke? Do you smoke alone or in the presence of other people? And do you believe the new law would help you to quit? If so, why? Well, the uh, uh, first of all, the new law that was put in place is not about me. It's about the next generation of kids coming up. So I think it's fair, Margaret, to just say that you just think it's neat to ask me about my smoking as opposed to it be, being relevant to my new law. But that's fine. I, I understand. It's, it's an it's a interesting, interesting human interest story. Look, uh, I've said before that uh, as a former smoker, I constantly struggle with it. Uh, have I fallen off the wagon sometimes? Yes. The, uh, am I a daily smoker, a constant smoker? No. Uh, I don't do it in front of my kids. I don't do it in front of uh, my family. Uh, and, you know, I would say that I am 95% uh, cured, but there are times where, <laughs> there are times where I mess up. And I, I mean, I've said this before. I, I get this question about once every month or so. And, you know, I, I don't know what to tell you other than the fact that, you know, like uh, folks who go to AA, you know, you, once you've uh, gone down this path, then, uh, you, you know, it's something you continually struggle with, which is precisely why the legislation we signed was so important, because what we don't want is kids going down that path in the first place.